see you. Good to see you. Did you say hello to President Clinton backstage? Yes, I did. I got a photograph of the two of you. When was this picture taken? Does the Secret Service get nervous when you raise your fist to the president? <laughs> <laughs> it seems like a risky move right there. Now, you're already a congressman. Uh, president Clinton was saying that he hopes that you eventually yeah. lead the Philippines. I mean, that you one day will, will run the country. Is that something that's, that's in your brain? Okay. All right. You're focused on that and also hopefully on boxing. And like President Clinton's wife, Hillary, of course, um, Secretary of State, yes. potentially running for president, your wife is a politician as well. Yes. And she's running for office right now? Uh, she's vice governor of the province. I mean, that's a power couple. Is it possible that she might one day run the country? Yeah, so you're saying no. <laughs> no. I know, oh, by the way, congratulations. I know uh, your wife, Jinky, is pregnant with your, uh, what, fifth child, right? Yeah. Fifth child. <laughs> Have you picked out a name? Israel. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Are you Jewish? <laughs> <laughs> you know, Jimmy is a nice name for a kid also. I mean, nothing against Israel, but, Jimmy, it, you know, it'd be nice. How many kids would you have to have before you named one of them after me? I may hold you to that. That's pretty good for me, I think. Yeah. Now, what if your wife goes into labor during oh. your fight? It's possible, correct? It's possible, yes. Uh, but, I would quickly... but would you still fight? Would you postpone the fight? No. You would not. You'd fight anyway. Yeah. Okay, all right. Now, the last fight was a, a, really a terrible injustice with Bradley. I mean, it was really a terrible decision. So... I think most people agree. I think maybe even... Do you think Bradley knows he lost that fight? I think so, but, uh, you know, because I... Yeah. Well, the judges did say he won the fight. Yeah. They seem to be the only ones that thought he won the fight. So now you go into a fight like this, and do you think... And I, you know, I, I have to knock this guy out. I, I can't rely on the judges. Is, is that something that goes through your mind, or you, you still want to win the fight on points? He has challenged that. He said a number of things about you. He said that he believes your killer instinct is not there. He said he'll be faster than you. He's hungrier than you. He says, if you don't knock me out, you're not going to win. He says, if you lose this fight, your career is probably over. Does that hurt your feelings? <laughs> Just you feel like you were too nice last time. Yeah. Then you can be nice. Then you make nice. Yeah. 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 Don't be nice this time. Yeah. Finish him off. Yeah. Well, I wish you luck, my friend. I hope you get a fair shake this time around. Thank you. Manny Pacquiao, everybody, is fighting Bradley for the second time, Saturday, April 12th, live on pay-per-view. Thanks to President Clinton. Thanks to Arden Hayes. Apologies to Matt Damon. We're out of time. Nightline is next. Good night.